I've heard all Danes are cursed with slow brains and fat tongues. Care to prove me wrong? Most men choose to be loud or stupid. Impressed that you manage both. I will take you on. Brilliant. Some flighting spirit. How about a wager? Here. Thank you. Let us begin. I have sparred against champions and bested each one. Prepare to taste bitter defeat once our battle is done. Oh, ho, ho, terrible. You're a misfit, a half-wit, a foolish old grouse. You're a snipe and a half-wit, a cretin, a clod. False flat. Young Earth, you'll take this easily. <laughs> This one is no match for you, young elf. I'm the greatest of flighters, a master of verse. Your prowling and your rhyming is worse. Got you there, young elf. Ha! <laughs> As predicted. A slow brain and a fat tongue. You were not worth the effort. Come find me you've honed your skills. Southeast. Bring the men to the gates of Tamworth. We'll flood the fields, and Burgred shall weep at the sight of what the future holds for this kingdom. Eivor, is your axe sharpened? I'm ready for the spear then. And the thunder of shields, yes. It's good to have you with us. To fight beside such legends is an honor. I've only heard tales of your conquests. Now I get to live them. We'll weave our sagas together. Thread upon thread. Come on, boy. We'll forge a man from your softness. Hammered on the anvil of does war. does need to fight to be Move! A... Move! Calm, Ivar. The fight's not here. Aye. The fight is nowhere to be found in this boy. A boy who happens to be Chilwolf's son. Why is he not in his quarters? Our future king wants a battle-hardened heir. Time he proves his worth, don't you think? Can't be an heir if he's dead, Ivar. Can he wield a sword? I've had some training. I only... I don't want to kill anyone. These men are my friends. My countrymen. Relax, little king. They won't call you friend now. You can thank your father for that. Ivar! He comes with us. And should anything happen to this little sprout, I will bear the punishment our future king inflict. Ha ha, <laughs> you hear that, boy? You die, and I'll have to kill your father, too. Mount up, Eivor. It's a long ride to Tamworth. Have to endure, my brother. He always finds new ways to humor himself. I'll keep that in mind. And both eyes open. You smell that, Chailbert? The stink of jealousy. Of our budding friendship, I think. What is Chailwolf's son doing in Repton at all? It's Chailwolf his loyalty. And there's no safer place for a traitor and his son. In the middle of a pack of days. Safe from whom? Mm -hmm. You and Ivar seem to have brought this Shire to hell. Fears are with us, the common folk. But 
Burgred still has his soldiers all over Mercia. They're devoted to him, and they'll die defending him. Your voice, Eivor. You sound different than the brothers. Good ear, Lord. Most in England cannot tell the difference. Not all Danes are Danes. From where do you come, if I may ask? North of the Danelands. A place called Thornburg, in Norway. I didn't know there was land north of there. What are the people like? You ever see a herd of sheep follow each other off the edge of a cliff? They're like that. The ones who remain, anyway. Oh. Couldn't have said it better myself. Was this a mass exodus from Norway, then? It was. Norway is now the king, Harald by name. A boy wise beyond his years. Are you not angry that he has displaced you and so many others? I was, for a time. But our weeks at sea have softened my brow fire. If I am honest, I realize I quite admire King Harald. I were to both. He has pacified the country I call home. For the first time in any man's memory, or any scald song, has just won. And that is quite a feat. That is impressive, truly. England is half the size of Norway, and yet we have four kings for our four kingdoms. You see? How could I not be impressed? No, Harald is a good man with grand ideas. I can see that now. I am only six years his junior, and have yet to see my first battle. I cannot imagine the skill and cuts. Your first coming, young Tilbert. From this day on, you may see rapid progress. I'm not sure I want so swift a rise. In truth, Ch it is my father who bears the heaviest weight of my anger, Harold. My father gifted my birthright to Harold without my consent or knowledge. As easily as if he might hand over a battle of me. It was not merely a deception. It was a betrayal of trust. The prick of which still stings me. Be it a blessing or a curse, family is always first. A good line, boy. Were you not an Adeling, I would hire you as my scold. Scold? Sounds something like sc our court poets. Is that what you mean? Right again. Fascinating. The harmony between our words and yours is quite something. As if we were distant cousins, separated by an ocean of time as well. I like out of that. I do. Look at these pagan rats. Ravenous, unseemly beasts teeming over holy ground. Have a care, Lord. These pagan rats outnumber us. I can see that, fool. What do we do about them? I advise we strongly consider their demands, Lord. We won't survive a fight. Is that you, Leofrit? How quickly you recover. I'm beginning to wonder if it is a man or beneath all that... A man of God stands before you, Eva. Proud and resolute. That's Burgred's war thing. Killed a dozen of our men in an ambush along the River Trent. It was Ivar's axe that stopped him. 
That is a poor description of a perfect 30-yard toss. Enough jawing, heathens! Speak your peace! We've come for your crown, Lord. With or without your head attached. Ha, I admire your ambition, pagan. But what you ask is impossible. No day ever has or ever will occupy Mercia's sacred throne. Would you settle for a Norse? We're not as gentle, but we're much better poets. <laughs> Norse, Dane, dog. You're all the same to me. All godless. My king, may I suggest a more measured approach to this? I grow weary of this palaver. You have trampled our lands, toppled our monuments. We've given you silver, fed your people. And yet, in spite of all this, your encroachment on my kingdom continues. No more! We will die defending what is ours, whatsoever the cost. If you want my crown, Uber Ragnarsson, you must pry it from the hands of my bloodless corpse. Man the walls! Round up the men. We're taking Tamworth tonight! Eivor, hey, tell the captain we're ready to march. Eivor and I will round up the men. Do you know your way around a batsman map? I've seen them in action. I want you at the helm of ours. You're strong and natural. I'll be there. As will I. to test your skill at all of. Who are you? I'm with the Ragnarsons. It's time to roll out the battering ram. Birgrid wanted to fight. Now we'll give him one. Are you ready to march now? Let's go. It's time to capture a kingdom. What are we going to do about him? Jailbird. Something wrong. I know these men, Eivor. I've supped with them. Not two weeks ago, Leofrith showed me how to wield a greatsword. He's a friend. Friendship's end. Often a... It cannot be that cold. Least of all with Leofrith. He is only following orders. When the march begins, find an empty tent and stay there. Do not think me a coward. I am not afraid of war. I do not want to kill my friends. There's no other way. Fight or hide. It's up to you.
them no place to hide. Have 
handle this. Idiot, press hard! Ah! Spill your brains! <laughs> no paradise where you're going! <laughs> It's up. Lay down your weapons and surrender. Take rear. Look around. See what you can find. I'll send for Chael Wolf. Tell him we found a throne. Ah, that was a good scuffle, hmm? But I did notice we were short one Athelic. Where was the son of our king? Chael? Found a letter. There's a symbol here. Your men have any luck? Nothing. You? This. Do you know that symbol? Tona Sigil. It seems she's been dealing with Burgred as well. The wretch. She was the mercenary barking at you in Repton, yes? She's playing both sides of this war. She could have told him anything. Sold him secrets about me, about Repton. Our plans. Why bother with all this pageantry? Fashion a new crown and stick it on your melon. There you have it. You're the new king. That is not how it works. Not Mercia. You were one of Burgred's thanes. You must have some sense of where he'd be. Burgred had his secret haunts, but he never told me of them. Kept me quite in the dark. For good reason, I suppose. Tana is our only lead. We talk to her. Find out what she knows. I would sooner launch my face into my axe than face her. That might improve her impression of you. We have the same father, Eivor, but his mother was a sow. Meet us at Tona's camp when you're finished here, and bring your patience and your axe. Eivor, a wolf you would. Go, I'll catch up. I will join the brothers, Eivor. Meet us at Tona's. My son told me what happened earlier, with Eivor pressuring him to fight. He said you intervened. You would be mourning your son if I hadn't. <laughs> He's not a fighter. No, but he should be. By trial or by training. He'll come around in time. But keep him from Ivar if you can. He's the furthest thing from a mentor.
area soon. Stretch your wings, Sunan. Rest, my friend.
This area is off limits. Oh. 